morning people, world, everywhere, whoever, wherever. Uh, welcome back to the channel, Half Fast 719. What we got going on today, which by the way, hopefully you guys are all well. Hopefully you guys are doing good. Hopefully nobody uh, is sick. Um, hopefully uh, everyone is doing well as far as uh, unemployment and stuff. Um, hopefully you're not unemployed. But if you are, hopefully uh, find something soon. Um, anyway, so today's video I'm going to be doing because I'm so bored and there's nothing to do and we really can't go anywhere. Um, I don't want to go anywhere because I don't want to get sick. And like I said in other videos, I don't want my family to get sick. So my kid is working and uh, we might run into town to the grocery store today, later. Um, might not, might go tomorrow. But anyway, so today's video, let's get to it. It's going to be this drill doctor. <clears throat> I've had this drill doctor for probably about 15 years or more, maybe 18 years. So since I don't have anything better to do, this is the model 350X, easier to use, makes dull drill bits like new, sharpens a wide variety of drill bit types and sizes. So as you can see, it does from 3 30 seconds to half inch, which is 2.5 millimeter to 13 millimeter. Carbide, cobalt, high speed steel and black oxide, titanium coated masonry, and standard twists. So, um, yeah, I think I tried to use this before. I could not figure it out to save my life. So, let's do like a, uh, an unboxing. I think I tried it on one or two drill bits when I first got it, and I was like, nope, I'm good. Um, and it was mainly because I was going through drill bits at work. So, let's see if I can't get this out of the box. Hold on. Hold on, people. irritated with using it because I just threw it in the box um, so it comes with an instructional DVD um, apparently they got a lot of their models I, I guess I got the cheapest one more than likely um, registration card instructions uh, I believe there's instructions because there's different degrees, different angles um, for this. So, Project Farm, he got me thinking about it, watching a bunch of his videos lately. So, anyway, hope you can see inside there. There's the little stone to sharpen the bits. So, uh, yeah, let me go ahead and try to figure this all out. Let me get it all plugged in. And uh, let me read through some instructions. And uh, I'll be back with some more detailed how-to, whatever, whatever. I'll be back. All right, so I sharpened two, two bits. Came out. This one came out pretty good. This one came out. Pretty good also. Um, I can't get that one to focus. They feel pretty sharp so what I'm going to do is these two are done. 
I'm gonna try to do a big a big bit. Let's see which one is more damaged. So this one's <coughs> this one's probably the the worst one I have. So that one's pretty bad. So let me go ahead and get it all set up. Sharpen it. So basically you open this up. Stick this chingy in there. Half inch. Start to close it. So it says you want, let's see, let's see, focus on this. So I want you to have these little tangs right there. I'll show you. Let me drop it out. So those little tangs, they want you to have it on the fluted side. So up against that like that. So and you want the right angle to or the right depth. So just putting it in like that. Like so. Ish. Tighten it down. Tight. So there we have that bit kind of beat up, chewed up. So let's try it out. So you put one on there first, that's one, that's two. I don't think I have it down far enough. So, what you do is loosen it. Oops. <laughs> bring it down a little farther. It doesn't say exactly how much you need to bring it down. I'm just spinning it. So that's just two passes. It already looks better. I guess it's a little bang. Looks like there we have it. 
it's gonna be your finished product so what I'll do is I'll take a couple of these drill bits and I'm gonna go drill this size a hole which I believe is 3 8 so I'll do a step up the three and uh, we'll go try them out real quick and then I'll run them back through the sharpener and then I have these to sharpen this this one does say it has uh, it can only do 118 degree uh, standard drill bits it says uh, normally 118 general purpose this general purpose point 118 degrees is used for drilling softer materials like cold rolled steel, aluminum, and wood and masonry bits. So it says that you can back here it says can I change it from 135 degree drill bit into a 118 de degree drill bit. It says you can change a point angle of any drill bit from 135 degree to 118 degree by normal sharpening procedures. So these drill bits are 135 degree so I'm assuming I'm going to have to cut cut them to 118 and these are 118 degree and uh, so that's that's all these drill bits so let's go uh, let's grab a drill from here And uh, let's go drill, drill a quarter inch plate.
All right, here we go. Quarter inch thick steel. Just some scrap that uh, I had laying around. So this is what I drilled yesterday to do the air compressor. So I'm gonna start with a 5.30 seconds drill bit. And I'm not using any, not gonna use any lube or nothing. Just gonna try to drill straight through. So let's see. Zoom in right there. Now we got to see if I can hold that spot. <laughs> through all right so let's step it up to 7 30 seconds a little bit pretty quick now step it up to 3 8 How we're due. I think the battery, yeah, the battery's dead in this. As you can see, one, but cut through it pretty quick. Pretty clean. Front and back are not too bad. So, anyway, head back over there and uh, do some more uh, sharpening, I guess. All right, guys. So, didn't actually turn out too bad. Um, let's see if we can't get it to focus. Come on forward. Anyway, they didn't uh, didn't do too much damage, if any at all. But uh, I will go ahead and just clean them up. Clean up the bits, and uh, yeah, they didn't they didn't get any damage. But I'm still gonna sharpen them. So I'm going to sharpen all these bits, and uh, that's pretty much all I'm going to do today, um, I think, unless I can find something else to do. Um, I do have a ton of drill bits. i got to find out all the angles and degrees of the uh, tips, and uh, go from there. So just do a little quick little fast motion time lapse, I guess. So I'll be back. Alright, guys. <clears throat> Hopefully you stuck in there that long. It's kind of chilly out here, so my nose is running. Anyway, I uh, gotta say, this thing's all right. Once I figured it out, I guess. <sighs> um, they say that stone should last like I don't even know, two hundred sharpenings. So 200 sharpenings, and then they say to take the stone off and flip it. But uh, anyway, I got all these sharp. Um, I'm going to go through these warrior ones and probably sharpen those. These were all the ones I used out of here. Um, I probably still need to sharpen. No. Everything's pretty sharp. Maybe I'll do that one. That one looks like. No, that one's sharp too. Um, everything else I don't think I've used. So I went through all the ones that shown showed uh, use. And uh, those are the ones I sharpened out of this set. This is the Warrior, Harbor Freight Warrior. Um, 
And then these are the Bauer, which I really like. I really like the Bauer. So I'll probably go through these and see which ones need sharpened. And, uh, and sharpen these too. So, um, anyway, just things I'm doing while I'm home. Um, because like I said at the beginning of the video, I can't go anywhere. Can't really do anything, so, um, yeah, that's it. Alright guys, uh, check out my other videos. Make sure you guys subscribe. Follow me on Instagram, halffast719. Um, let me know what kind of content you guys want to see. So I can get more, uh, viewers, or whatever. Um, because I am kind of sporadic and I do just pretty much everything. So, alright guys, thanks for watching. Subscribe, comment, do what you guys do. Later.